Hi, this is Andrea from Tech Support in Corvina. And uh, now that uh, our device appears online, uh, there are a few more things that we can, uh, we can do, depending on what type of usage we want to uh, do with our Excel device. So, in case we want to reach some endpoints and our device is simply a gateway to some PLCs, for example, we have to go in uh, services and then enable the functionality router NAT port forwarding. This will enable the device to forward our request and uh, VNC connection, for example, or other protocols towards other endpoints that are uh, occurring in the other Ethernet ports of the device. In this case, you can click on Edit and then enable it. We simply leave it as it is now. So no further modifications are needed. Save. Uh, the device will ask for a reboot, so we simply click on Yes. And the rebooting process will start. Okay, now that the device has been uh, rebooted, we can uh, log in again and we can go on the network tab to check our connection settings. On the network interfaces, we can check how our device is uh, connected and we can check also the other connections that are available. As you can see here on the Ethernet Zero, it corresponds to our internet connection and it is the one that actually uh, connects the device to Corvina. Um, along with it, we have another port, which is Ethernet 1, that can be used to, um, to reach some endpoints. And uh, in this case, we have not configured the Ethernet 1 with, uh, with um, an IP address. In case we have uh, endpoints, we need to configure this port as well with uh, a private internet address.